the man, the myth, the legend. Mm -hmm. It's ready to cut. See that? I tend to overindulge. I really love actually having some control over where my money's going. Cheers to that. She just hopped on him bareback and she is- Look at all the hair. It's okay, buddy. We had a change of heart, change of plans. and we really are in the kitchen I mean obviously I'm really in the kitchen but I'm I'm cooking I'm making things y'all long time no see I feel like I haven't I feel like I haven't it's been a while it's been too long um it's been a pretty busy five-ish days I honestly feel like I haven't been home home in like five days um so there was the yeah there was a day of prepping for the horse show. I don't remember if I showed any of that. Um, so that was going on. Our friend Wendy came and we cleaned horses and we got them all spick and span and ready to go. And then we had our first show. I did not video any that day other than some of the um, children's rides, but I can't show that on here because there's music playing in the background and YouTube doesn't like that and I would get flagged and all the things. But, um, we were on our horses for, let's see, the show started at 9 and we got done at 6.15 and we were only off our horses for about 20 minutes. So you do the math because I'm not real good at that, but it was a long day. <laughs> Last year we showed in about five classes a piece. This year it was about 20, okay? Our, 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 our bottoms were planted all day, but it was so good. Um, everyone did good. Sis and I both got reserve high point whatever you want to call that, second place in our division. So we won a couple classes and we did okay in some other classes. Wesley did really good. He had several seconds and thirds and fourths and um, everybody did good. So it was a great day. Um, we stayed busy. And then there's, there's the man, the myth, the legend. What have you been working on? You've been working on, so the past few days you've been working on belts, air condition, because you know, Air conditioning's important in the tractor and it never fails that they go out when we need them. So, how's that going? I'm finished. He's finished. Okay. What do you, so you're done with that now? I'm done with that and I got to try the other two. I got some meat in my teeth. Um, okay. All right, check that off. Um, then I went out of town. I went to the river for a few days. Uh, my neighbor down there, he's like a grandmother, turns 100 today, actually. So, happy 100th birthday to Miss Ann. She's amazing, a World War II vet. She's just amazing. She looks amazing. She's got her mind. She's like, she's just an awesome lady. And so, I wanted to go see her. I missed all the festivities because it was the same as the show day. But I did get down to see her. My Aunt Noni was in her camper. So, I, she was up from Florida. So, I got to visit with her. We had a good couple of days in the wind and the cold down at the river. Um, of course, it was beautiful when I left. Came home last night. And here we are. And it's beautiful today. It's rained half the day, but now the sun's shining. It's like 70. It's amazing. I was just looking. That hay that you just fertilized, it looks like it's really coming up better, isn't it? I mean, it's like shot up. Or it's headed out. Am I right? In some places. In some places. Yeah, okay. It looked like it to me. So, I guess that's coming up. What about the fescue? It looked like it was about ready to cut. Yeah, it's ready to cut. It's ready to cut. Um, I just looked at the weather. It's going to be in the 80s towards the end of next week. You think hay weather? Well, that's what I'm figuring next week. That's what he's figuring. Y'all, we might be in the hay field next week. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Tell him. Tell him. Um, so, yeah, that's where we're at. Tonight, we have church we have what do you call it potluck so i'm actually making like thanksgiving food here i'm making a roast because that's the easiest thing for me to do to take like meat wise and then i'm making a sweet potato casserole because i got a lot of sweet potatoes and i just thought that would be good so that's what i'm doing wesley's going to finish doing some mowing he's mowing for a neighbor so while i was gone they had all sorts of issues and lost a tire off the 
mower and it was all sorts of fun, but they got that, not ours. <laughs> um, they got that straight. That ended up being a two day ordeal, but um, all's well that ends well. I think he said he had one little tiny piece and he was going to finish that now. The kids are within two to three weeks of finishing all their school for the year. So it's like we're wrapping things up just before the farm really explodes and we get super busy. So, all right, 4.45. That's just, that's just catching you up on things and let's make a casserole. All right. Got our sweet potatoes and butter and milk and eggs and pumpkin pie spice and cinnamon and sugar. All right, I just took a little walk because it is so lovely out here and I have not walked in days now, y'all. Days. It just feels good to get out here. Look, you see that? Got my mail here. You see that? That's the fescue. And that right over there is the Matua. And it's um it's definitely higher than it was last week, even. Um we did get a little bit of rain after he fertilized. It's patchy. It's just it's real patchy. So I don't know, y'all. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna see. We knew it was a little bit of a gamble, as is every bit of farming, but isn't that pretty? <laughs> beautiful for what it's worth I um just a reminder here I just made a post today on my Facebook um the, the y'all y'all the scammers are out in full full force here lately um fake accounts bot accounts whatever you want to call them bad people <laughs> doing bad things and um I know you see the comments on here. You get fake comments. Just know that there's only one me. There's only one of my accounts, but a lot of times they use my profile picture and they use my handle, but the username is gonna be different in some way, okay? So, just at the sake of beating a dead horse here, I will never ask you for money. Never, 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 never. I will not ask to for you to contact me via phone or email or another uh, platform, another message, messenger app, or anything. Um, I'm married. I have no desire or, um, what's the word, inclination. I don't know, y'all. I'm just tired. I have, I'm not, I'm not looking to solicit any relationships with any men, okay? So don't, please. If you get a message that looks like it's from me that sounds like that, it's not me. Don't be duped. Don't be duped. Stay vigilant. Stay aware. Block and report. That's all we can do. And the higher-ups don't really seem to care, so it doesn't really seem to matter a whole lot. But if we block them, then at least that one account doesn't have access anymore. Can't bug you. Can't bug me. So that's what um, I'm trying to stay on top of it, but I need your help. So that's that. That's that. That's all I'm going to say about that right now. Oh, y'all, it's so pretty. What a really good reminder right here, right now, for me to just keep looking up. Keep looking up, y'all. I see you, God. I see you. I know you're there. Oh, man. You're going to make all things right and all things new. Hmm. Look. Let's just keep doing that, y'all. Let's just keep looking up. Okay, y'all. I'm actually really, I'm really happy with the way my little roast turned out. I put two big roasts in the Instapot because they were frozen and I didn't have time to thaw them. And they were in there like two, two and a half hours. Two hours and then 30, the last 30 minutes I put the potatoes in and they're like obviously way done. But this is so good. Um, I feel like with all these roasts that I've been cooking, I've, um... I've kind of mastered just the regular pot roast now. So this one, I put a packet of brown, I just put a packet of everything I can find. A packet of brown gravy, some ranch seasoning, some um, Lipton up Lipton onion soup mix, a can of beef consomme that I had in the pantry, 
and I put another can of water with that, I probably could have left the water out and then it wouldn't have been quite as soupy. Um, and some salt and some pepper and it's really tasty. So that's good. Put the lid on that. The sweet potato casseroles are cooking and um, we're getting closer. I need to go, I need a vacuum. I don't want to, but I'm trying to psych myself up. Yeah. Okay, I'm back in the kitchen and um, I wasn't gonna share this with y'all, but it's kind of fun. So I'm about to make me a little, we're gonna call it a mocktail. <laughs> um, I don't usually drink these, um, what do you call, I don't even know what you call them. They're like sparkling water, soda water. What do you call these things? Oh, sparkling water. But I've started drinking them a little bit just for something different because all I drink is water. So I'm just trying to change it up a little bit. So I got these little LaCroix and get them at Aldi because you know, groceries are astronomical. So I try to buy there when I can. And um, I've got all this kick lately of incorporating some apple cider vinegar at least a tablespoon a day. Just eyeball that. And um, since we're going to church potluck, I tend to overindulge, but <laughs> that's putting it very mildly, um, especially with dessert. So I'm hoping that by doing this like an hour before we go, 30 minutes before we go, um, it will maybe curb some of the cravings and it will offset some of the carbs that I'm about to ingest. And hopefully maybe I will not want to take one of the 30, like one each of the 30 desserts, maybe I can stick to like five or six. That's my goal. And then this stuff right here is my new best friend. It's called Fiber Wise. If you didn't know it, fiber is important for you, especially the older you get. <clears throat> yeah. And this stuff, well, whatever it, <clears throat> don't do that. Just drink it. Don't, don't try to inhale it. Um, I use two scoops right there. So that's gonna get me 25 grams, I think. 35, no, no. <laughs> Where are we at, Mayor? Doo, 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 doo. 14, whatever. Anyway, it's a lot. Um, it tastes like strawberry. I, I did this the other night and I was like, okay, this tastes like a strawberry daiquiri without the bad stuff, without the alcohol and the other bad stuff, no sugar. So, that's what we're doing. Now, you cannot, let me see how this tastes. It's really good. I'm not, I'm not lying, y'all. It's like a yummy, mm. I think I could actually put it in a blender with ice and that would be like a slushy. Anyway, I'm probably gonna start having this before I eat supper. Um, it's amazing. Fiber wise, if you're interested in trying this, you can't find it online. You can't buy it on Amazon. You can't buy it at Walmart. You can't buy it in the big box stores. Um, it's an exclusive. And if you're interested, I will provide a link where you can find it and all the other cool stuff that our family is using now. <sighs> USA owned. I just, I just really love, I really love actually having some control over where my money's going. Hello, tax season. Who just had to pay tax? I had to pay some for my business, I did. And um, I don't have any control where that money goes. Okay, they're done. But I have control where my money goes for the things that we use and spend as a family. And um, this new this new company is getting about, like I can get about 60, 70% of what we use from this company. So anyway, cheers to that. All right, all right. Now I think we're gonna, um, I think we're gonna score. Yeah, not bad. We hope. Okay, well, we just got home from church, and Austin, in true Austin fashion, decided it would be a great night to take Rip over there with the sheep <laughs> and the calf, so he can, um, he can eat down some of the grass. So. She just hopped on him bareback and she is loping down the road. <laughs> oh me. <laughs> What's the matter, Rip? What's the matter? What's he scared of? Oh my gosh, he doesn't know what to think. 
What is it? Oh, yeah, that's right. He he's blowing. Him. No, he hasn't. He's road in it, but he hasn't been over here since the sheep were out there in it. <laughs> he's blowing at us. What is it, buddy? <laughs> You're going to put me in there with them? <laughs> oh. Y'all, look at all the sheep. Look at all the hair. They're shedding so bad. They're rubbing up on the fence. Oh my gosh. Well, what are you barking at, lady? She doesn't Come here, lady. Come here, girl. I think he's scared of all the sheep. Yeah, I think he is too. <laughs> hey, girl. Hey, girl. Rocket. Hey, baby. Hey. Let's go in here and see what happens. Come here, Rocket. <laughs> I don't think I'll hurt him. All right. He's not going to hurt him, I don't think. No, but he doesn't know what to do with them. I don't know what they are. They don't know what he is. Yes, they do. Look at Lady out there. What is it, Whippy? He's blowing. She doesn't know what they are. <laughs> oh boy. It's okay, buddy. Gosh. <laughs> hey Reba, it's okay. He's not gonna hurt you. <laughs> Reba's like, what? Oh, oh lady's got a zoomies. <laughs> Look at her jumping on the sheep. What is it, lady? Look at lady. <laughs> Go see him, Ruby. <laughs> them what am I supposed to do with them do I just chase them what do I do good night sleep tight don't let Rippy bite or or I'm um, seven we had a change of heart change of plans and came back to get him I was afraid Lawrence said we probably shouldn't have left him in here in case he went to pawing at the fence. Seven is trying to jump on him. I don't know why. Since there's not another horse in here with him in case he got worried. So we're going to put him in here tomorrow with like Hank or somebody. We can't put Little Doc in here because he, um, he tries to eat the sheep and the calf. Okay. Did you enjoy your little your little visit? We'll come back tomorrow. I got it. They're good. I got I got two dogs in here. I know. I know. No. 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 I know. What are y'all talking about? What are y'all talking about? What is it? What is it? Yeah, tell me. Tell him, Duke. How's it go? How's the song go? Oh, okay. Oh, that didn't sound good. Hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> I'm back. I've been gone all 20 minutes. <laughs>